Fiona is uh, currently studying, undertaking a PhD in the University of Ulster and the, the piece that she has in this show is all to do with playing with substance and playing with you know what your eye assumes and what actually exists. So for this piece obviously you've got what looks like a ton of bricks falling from the ceiling but actually if you were to touch those bricks they actually are very very light made of foam. Um, so we thought that this would be a great way to start the, um, start the exhibition with a real bang. That is a piece called Through the Looking Glass by Christopher McKinney, he lives in Armagh. And he uh, took an image that um, he's known very well from his childhood, which is a stained glass window from the cathedral in Armagh, which he would have known very well, sat under it whenever he was in Mass. What the piece does is it starts off with a stained glass image, very traditional, and once you press a button, it opens up and fragments and then comes back together again. So the whole idea of that was um, taking a structure, a set of ideals or a set of um, rules, I suppose, that maybe you knew from your childhood, that, you know, very cosy. It's a piece that's very easy to read, it's very safe. And then it's the cycle of it fragmenting and coming back together, which is sort of representing how people you know, rebel against those structures and try and, you know, in their lifetime and then maybe come back to it over time. Bottles Upstairs is a piece of sculpture called Iceberg by Martin Boyle and Martin's been collecting uh, plastic bottles off the streets of Belfast for about 20 months now and um, in his studio he has made this immense sculpture called Iceberg which is obviously like a, 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 the shape of an iceberg from the bottles and it sits really well up in Gallery 3 because just behind it is a, the image of a shipwreck so you kind of have these two together which works really well. This piece is by an artist called Michael Hanna and it's called Mouth Chamber and uh, it's been, a couple of people have come in today and said it's somewhere between 2001 Space Odyssey and Flight of the Navigator. It's a huge uh, contraption that basically emulates the inside of a mouth. So when you go in, you sit in a red leather chair and you're basically the tongue. And Michael has, through microphones and speakers, he has recreated this, the phonetic alphabet and uh, you kind of feel it and the, this, it's an audio sensation experience when you go in there. It, this is an exhibition by Jack Doherty. Uh, he's a ceramicist and uh, potter. Uh, he is uh, chair of the Craft Potters Association uh, across the UK and is the head potter at uh, the Leach Pottery in Corn St Dives in Cornwall. He's originally from Coleraine, which is why his work's important to us. His, his career has taken him through Kilkenny and Herefordshire primarily, where he's uh, where he's produced his work. Uh, but his work, it's very distinctive work. Uh, the colours are particularly impressive. So there's a uh, there's a tremendous subtlety to it, but it's a subtlety that brings out the wonder or the glory of the ceramic itself. It's a, it's a, it's really, it, it's fascinating to see it. It looks so gentle, but when you see it together, it has quite a powerful impact.